All right, Sunday morning, race day. I thought I might just get my hair done before we leave. Races don't usually start this late. This race starts at 9 a.m. I think I'm a bit unlucky with the weather this year because I'm sure they weren't expecting a 35 degree day. And it's gonna be a long, long, long and hot day. in this race is massive anyway only one goal for today <laughs> not getting lost I'll see you guys in about seven or eight hours I'm gonna leave you in my bag so just keep an eye on my stuff <laughs> all right see you soon wish me luck <laughs> Alright, good news, did not get lost and I also won the race, so overall a pretty good day. Still waiting for Silky, she's still running out there, so hopefully it won't be told too long before she finishes. actually gonna name a tree um, under my name and it will probably last there forever so I think it's actually quite cool Silky is still running finished about three hours ago she's still running it is a longest run so I'm a little bit worried but she's never DNF'd in any race in her life so I'm sure she'll do well she she's a tough little cookie Sweetie, I missed your finish. What happened? It was so pain. I had the same thing as I had in Israel. Well, I can't tell you how many times I stopped on the trails. And I just came from checkpoint to checkpoint. The first, you okay? the first 20k went so well. It was like in two hours. On the second checkpoint, I had a watermelon, and after that, uh, my stomach just struggled so much. I was thinking so many times I will not finish, not finish, and I just uh, went from checkpoint to checkpoint. I'm okay. happy I finished, but I'm so exhausted. It was such a mental game. Good day overall today. Finally, I didn't get, did not get lost, and I won the race. Silky ran the longest race, which I think is is truly amazing. But now we gotta drive for two and a half hours back to Frankfurt. <laughs> Thank you. 